guys, I hope you're all doing well. Welcome back. Let's play some more of our EU4 Byzantium campaign here. We are going to get Basilius and we are going to marry Nostrum like you do. When you're playing as Byzantium, I feel like it's the natural path. But uh, there's a couple of quick housekeeping things. You guys have been awesome with the support. Like so awesome to the point where we have actually made the decision that we are going to cut the Terraria series from the channel and we are going to keep Basilius and we're going to bump it up to twice a day. Um, the demand is there. I want to fill it. So we're going to bump it up to twice a day. Um, that being said, we're going to change it to the, the light goal is now going to be 300. So as long as every, each Basilius video is getting 300 likes within the first six hours. So that, that's my criteria. 300 likes in the first six hours. We're going to keep it twice a day. At which point, if it falls below that, we will dump down to once a day. And then if it dips below the 150 mark, that's when we're going to go to every other day. So I hope I made that clear. Like I said, I want to make what you guys are enjoying. Dutch campaign, still going strong. So you guys have been awesome with your support. But regardless, let's get into it. So big things I want to do is I want to attack these guys here. Um, the only problem is, is if I attack... Yeah, so I want to go to war. But I really don't want to go to war with these guys. Caraman and Dasavir, Dasavir, whatever. So, do we for, do we just do some huge at-home battle over here with, um, with these guys? We can take Kosovo and we could, you know, probably transfer over vassalage of him. I don't know. We're kind of backed into a corner here, I'm not going to lie, but i got to think about it. Kandar would be an easy target. AQ and Ramazan. What's he going with? Defensive ideas, morale of navies. Core creation cost would be a good one. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's, that's quite good, actually. So Anatolian ideas. Do they have core creation costs as well? Huh. It wouldn't be my vassal, though. AQ and uh, Ramazan. Ramazan, Ramazan. Interesting. Just taking a look around, seeing what's what's going on. Ottomans, we're not going to be able to attack them anytime soon. Bulgaria, do you have any claims on Wallachia? He's just got that core over there. <clears throat> so let's have him get some claims on Wallachia. And then if you want to get any claims over here, that's fine with me as well. This is all my uh, my intention. So we're not going to be able to go to war with these guys anytime soon. So let's go ahead and bring them home. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. And we're just going to speed five it for a moment. We still have some housekeeping stuff we're going to need to get sorted out before anything interesting is going to happen. Don't want to waste any of my golden era, so we're going to make sure we are being as uh, productive as we can on that stuff. Is there anything useful for this? Unrest, discipline... Manpower recovery speed would be nice, but I don't know. Colonialism will be here before too long as well. It's tough. I don't know. Disputed succession in Poland. It's worth a try. Okay, so. <laughs> I was thinking about trying to ally him. He's allied to two of the same people that Austria is. Memmingen and Palatinate. I'm not so sure. Brandenburg. They have a von Habsburg on their throne, right? Because von the, they claimed the throne, actually. So I remember that. Let's go ahead and get some um, spy network on these guys. Trebizonid is disputed succession. Imoretti would be a nice PU, or a vassal, I should say. Infantry combat ability and fort defense. Oh, they have the same. They have Georgian. Interesting. Yeah, they'd be a great vassal to have. Just thinking. Trebizond is... They have their own ideas, right? Trebizond? Chance of new air and legitimacy. Well, that's not quite... That's not very useful. 
Let's see here. Do we state this yet? Nope. It's not worth. Let's go ahead and pay that off so we can keep on converting lands. Huh. Love losing points. Let's go ahead and take that. More money is better. Very good. It is a fact. So let's see here. Can I give any land to the burgers? Totally. Give them Huda Vendigar since it's a trade center. Go ahead and take that money. And uh, we'll take a general from you guys. We're going to have rebels, Ottoman separatists. Get you guys over here. So where is the dev? It's like this province here is what it looks like. This Denizli. Let's go ahead and uh, turn up their maintenance. Lose a little bit of money, but it's fine. Oh, they're in Sugla. It's fine. They have no general, which is really nice. That is ideal. Do we want promoted cultures or monthly autonomy change? I'll take the uh, autonomy change. So we didn't lose too many men from that, so that's good. Maybe for those guys to pop now. There we go. Oh, we can probably start working on... Oh, they're all the wrong religion. Of course. I'm being a goof. Very good. That'll help our income out a bit as well. We need to revoke this guarantee on them. No point in having it. Should probably get some alliances. Imeretti will make a good alliance. So he got busted over here. So let's just go ahead and make that claim. Would it be worth? Not right now. I just don't have any manpower, man. That's my problem. This stuff is going to be all stated up now, so it can start getting converted over. We'll royal marry them, that's fine. Free admin points, sounds good. Go. These Catholic zealots are not ever going to fire. I definitely don't need that fort on roads anymore. Yeah, just get rid of that thing. It's costing us monies. We don't need to be spending that money. Let's get an admiral if we can. We're ahead on tech, so let's just go ahead and get one. Zero uh, maneuver, so that's always good to see. We are now up to force limit, or up to our maximum. I don't see any reason why we shouldn't just, uh, you know, build an army, get some mercs maybe. I think they would make a great vassal. And then we could have them, you know, I'm not sure. I could attack Mamlex right now. And I think I could probably handle them. I would have to be smart with my fighting, but I think I could probably handle them. Like this is woods. I'm not sure. Oh my goodness. Build those improvements, baby. More money. Beautiful. All that money. That's good stuff. Think I probably should build up. Let's go ahead and get more cav in the army. As we can afford it, we'll take it. Papal State has announced me as their rival. Hmm. 
Interesting. Don't mind the Discord notification. Wallachia. So have you guys gotten any claims? They've gotten a few claims. Let's go ahead and declare that war. That's an easy one. We shouldn't even need to un take it off a of speed five for this one. Beautiful stack wipe, and that's all she wrote. Our patriarch authority is going up fast. We can get a couple of cannons, so we should get one. Should get our uh, our value cannon in there. Keep our prestige nice and high. I don't mind falling behind on admin. Doesn't matter to me. We'll probably full annex him. I don't see any reason why we shouldn't. Um. Hmm. Which one do I want to do? I don't have any army professionalism. I don't need the mill points. Let's take a loan out for it. It's whatever. I don't care. We're far enough ahead on mill that I'm not going to let it bother me. I'm actually going to spend a few points on some dev. Kind of get that manpower pool ticking up a bit. And uh, keep on converting stuff. So Carisi is going to be... Huh. Seat of Strong Aristocrat, huh? Go ahead and um, switch this one over here to local missionary strength. That'll help with that. There we go. So, let's give... Uh, do we just take it all for ourselves? I think that might be too much AE. No, we can handle that. It's, I'm not going to be able to core it. I'm only going to be able to core these... So what's Tergoviste's 20 dev? It's a lot of overextension to sit on, but that's fine. It's fine. There we go. Just took an idea group as well, so. Let them complain, it says. Couple people joining a coalition. I'm not too concerned about it. Ooh. Didn't even know our truce was up with these guys. Definitely not these guys. So wait, yeah, we have a truce with them? Oh, we have a truce with them. They don't have one with us. Ah, okay. That makes sense. Okay, well, let's make another friend if we can. Tunis. They're a strong friend. Poland, Bohemia, Brandenburg. Brandenburg would be a really good one. I think I need a few more troops if I really want to be like showing up as a major power. Caraman would be a good va good rival. I'm going to go ahead and do that. Let's see what we need to be reconquering. So I need to take some land from Venice, which will give me permanent claims on a bunch of... Malta, Valerius, and Western Mediterranean. So that's like over here. And then where else are we at? Right here, the coastline. So I need this one province. So it looks like our next major war will be against these guys. And it would also allow me to single out Caraman. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to go to war with Venice anytime soon unless I attack the Pope, who I'm going to also have to fight England. But... Uh, that's a tough one. Okay, let's get you guys down there. Let's go ahead and uh, turn off all these forts. We don't need any of them except for the one up here, which we will keep to uh, fight off that devastation. Let's go ahead.
Four taxes is always a good one. Let's go ahead and get a few more men in the field. Just so we're not we don't need to be so on our toes. Army is certainly oh and they declare they declared it. Okay. Well, that's fine. I'm not too concerned, honestly. If anything, Caraman just dug their own grave. So let's get our general over here. This will be a show superiority war. Yeah, our emperor is good. I'm not going to make him a dude. Let's come on down here, see if we can catch some of these guys out. We can fight them on the mountains. We have superior numbers. We'll just outflank them. And that's literally his navy just gone, just dead. Let's do that. Let's go ahead and get a repair tick for these guys. San Antonio de something. Ten more galleys for me to eat. Sounds good. Um, Durazo. What? Okay, maybe we can stack wipe them. Beautiful. Let's go ahead and grab these boats, see if we can get Genoa pieced out. Wow, it sunk a heavy too. Go, get these ones. Dude, we've lost so many ships. We haven't lost a single ship. Okay, I'm going to get these guys transferred over there so I don't lose Napoli. Okay, very good. Hopefully we don't lose a 14% siege tick. Let's go ahead and uh, put on defensiveness there. Go ahead and turn defensiveness on here as well. And let's get you guys over here. They will be flanking me. They won. What a joke that is. That's a funny joke. Are they going to reinforce? Uh, I think we should still win. They are still flanking me, but... Yeah. I don't care about the manpower. Just give me my fort back. Such a stupid joke. Alright, let's go ahead and get you guys up there. Bulgaria should be able to handle these guys down here. Huh. So I'm going to take Durazo. And let me see here. So I'm going to have to take these three provinces right there. So something like... Okay. We'll see. I'll see what I can siege down with that stack. We'll go ahead and take Miltech ahead of time. It's not a problem for me. Okay, so when we have the mill points, we can barrage this fort as well. Ooh, he is no longer the Emperor. It's quite good for us. Well, I guess it's not, because it would seem like Bohemia isn't rivaled to him, so Bohemia would not back him up, which is not ideal. Let's also finish coring up that land, which apparently I never did. For some reason, I have a half a stack there. You guys deserve to get stack wiped. There we go. Go ahead and barrage the fort. Where's Bulgaria? There's just 14k walking up there. Don't know why. Don't make no sense. Maybe they're going for Trent? Who else are you at war with right now? Just me? 
Oh, they're blockading that. Lost the Siege of Sugla. That's no fun. Well, I have some uh, professionalism, so we should probably spend it. Get that manpower pool back. Tunis raiding all my stuff like Tunis does. Apparently we have Corfu, which is kind of nice. Come on now, Genoa. There we go. Go ahead and kill off his navy. I like that. Okay. Um, let's come on and walk back down to Salento. Get you guys into Napoli. I didn't make it in before the end of the month. Feels bad. It's fine. So they are now trapped on that fort, regardless of whether they take it or not. So let's go ahead and just split them in half. Put these guys over here. And we are going to... Siege down Durazo. Let's go ahead and just grab some mercs. Okay, apparently they have 2k stack there, so that's not going to work. Damn it, that's annoying. Okay, that's fine. Let's go ahead and get you guys grouped up over here. Somehow my guy got stuck over here, even though I had military access, but then it just randomly I didn't. Okay, all my transport's getting grouped back up. Let's go ahead and get you guys over here into uh, Epirus. Yeah, I don't think so, turds. No, wait, what? How did that happen? Like, walk me through that. I could have sworn that I just blockaded it, but... Oh, good. Whatever. They broke the siege off, so... I guess that's fine with me. Okay, let's go blockade him for a little bit of war score. That's what I'm talking about. That's a lot of war score. And we're going to need to siege this down as well. Probably won't be able to get Durazo. Oh, I forgot about him already. Man, they're getting beat up on. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> I totally forgot about them. Oh, Bulgaria's on Venice. Nice. Get you guys over there. So... Oh yeah, I think we'll totally be fine. Because all these guys that would be joining the coalition are going to get kicked out anyway, so I think we're totally golden. Nah, I care, man. You can slob the knob, man. Let's see if we can maybe fish for a pew with them. So Poland would be my friend. I'm going to go ahead and Royal Marry them. They're rival to Austria so and Bohemia, so I need to be aware that they will probably help me if I need them. Hello? I'm clicking on it. There we go. 5,000 troops. They're going crazy. So that's the piece I want, at the very least. I think I'd like to take Corfu as well, since it is Greek. Austria would join, and it would be only them. So let's go ahead and like take some money from them as well. There we go. That is beautiful. Definitely don't have any admin points. <laughs> Whatever. It's fine. So we're getting all that cored up. We can turn off some of these forts over here. I'll keep a few of them on. Definitely don't need this one anymore. Don't need this one turned on. This one stays on. Very good. All right, so let's get you guys over here and get you guys like over in Chios. Whatever. Uh, we'll rival Osterike. We will turn army maintenance down. We will suppress rebels in random spots that I have rebels. And uh, there we go. Now we're just gonna slowly but surely start working on getting stuff integrated because this unrest is going to be pretty gnarly for a while it's going to be a few more months let's 
see. Portugal, will you marry me? Nah, probably not. Go ahead and ally Poland. Bohemia would help them. That's unfortunate, man. Poland wouldn't even help me. Huh. Guess I can't promise him Hungarian land. That's my assumption. So as soon as we finish with Sugla, we can consecrate this metropolitan, which will be nice. Oh, maybe not. Nope, we cannot. Wait, yeah, we can. Let's um, take the unrest guy. That actually would be really useful. Wallachian separatists. Let's go ahead and turn maintenance back up for a moment. Yeah, as soon as we get our unrest down. Oh yeah, we're fine. We're not gonna have rebels. Nice. Oh, uh, we also need to make sure we're turning off these edicts as well. Costing me a bunch of money. It's actually just... Oh, we finished stating that. Mm. Yeah, right. Okay. So then, once the next year rolls around, we'll be able to... Uh, let's go ahead and do these buttons as well. Get our free points. Go ahead and give the clergy a little bit of land. Make them more influential. Give them, like... Those two is fine. And then general, diet, and then all that stuff. Very good. So, get rid of the one that isn't good. Let's go ahead and get this guy in charge of there. And there we go. And then I immediately get an event that will piss off the burgers or the nobility. All right. Well, goodbye, nobility. And then once December... And January roll around. Go ahead on Diplotech. Get the cost, and then we can start converting more of this stuff over here. Let's go ahead and turn those guys back down, and cool. I think that'll do it. Hope you guys are enjoying. Like I said, 300 likes per video, and we will keep the twice daily uploads rolling. I think it is a bit of a high goal, but I think we totally can do it. We have had... Legit nuts support on the first few episodes, and I don't see any reason why that's, uh, you know, that would be too much to ask for. So, if you guys want it, go ahead and show your support and show me you want it. Um, don't forget to check out the Discord and the Patreon. Links are in the description down below. And with all of that being said, this is Chewy Shoot, and I'll catch you guys later. Special thanks to Bloodbound92, Yudaldo, Jaron Clampett, CWG Dutch Terror, Valentel, Corbett Gaming, Palmer, Classified for Life, Airborne Animal 7, Uncle Donald, Lambda Driver, Damian Hartvig. You guys rock. I appreciate you. Don't forget to subscribe. Catch you guys later.